Hello. Oh, can you hear me? Yeah. Yeah. I apologize that my voice I seems to still not really recover. <laughs> and but I think <coughs> it's much better now. Now, <laughs> not not last night. And first is firstly thank you uh, Bruno and other organizers for inviting me and invite LMB uh, EM facility here. I'm really happy to see a few the LMB people or ex LMB people <laughs> here. And yeah, and I has me enjoyed the last. Uh, uh, one day, one day, uh, uh, meeting so far. So here today, I just uh, saw a few slides about our uh, EM facility, uh, what we have, what we're doing, and some statistic, some application. So at the, the and at the end part, I just uh, talking about uh, what um, the, the few few thing when you running this uh, like big facility, we have a lot of. Uh, uh, like a lesson to learn and still explore it and then hope uh, this kind of lesson and, and, uh, and experience also useful for other facility and I like your your feedback and contribute so be grateful so I will start with the ne next slide just introduce the people <coughs> current we have so we have uh, we have four people here now um, but we, we we has uh, recent two years. We fortunately have four, and some. And then we we great, We hope next year we hope we can get another one. But this was we we just see. And the for the EM, the. Hey. <coughs> to jump. <laughs> okay. Um, yes, a little bit history of LMB EM facility. Uh, you know the 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 facility is we when we separate from the Cavendish laboratory from the University of Cambridge. Uh, so in fact we moved to the new building. So it's a nineteen sixty two. So this new new building. So we then mean totally moved out from Cambridge before still. Part part of the Cambridge in the uh, in the old old Dunning uh, side, and from from that time, uh, uh, a few a uh, group of the pioneers like like um, Hugh uh, Huxley, um and John Finch and all other people. They well at the beginning they only use electron micro as their main main tool. So at that time we have all sort of the early EM here. <coughs> I, I put a little slide uh, about two years uh, two years ago, so we can see we have all sort of thing until uh, well, until I uh, the the eighties is uh, come to become become thermal official or FEI. We got this uh, all CM and so from from that time is uh, Nigel Ayn and Richard Henderson are using all. This kind of thing start from their their all the research, so and then the first fact come from 1993, uh, and this is the most difficult to use fact microscope in the world. So it, but in fact, but this one give a lot of machine, a lot of people come from this one now is all the head of the other the group in, in the whole whole world of cryo EM. So but when I come. When I joined, this one got some color. When I joined in, so this one just ready to depart because it's so difficult to use, and then eventually we sell out to part to other group people as a spare part, <laughs> like Polaro now. Yeah, people get rid of it. So from the from the from this uh, nine, uh, so upgrade to at that time of the the first Tech Nine, Tech Nine version, and then. When I come here, I I we buy I, I buy this Polara to to in, install to replace one of the F F twenty. In fact, <coughs> now we buy F twenty back. <laughs> but it's still very useful. So and uh, so we gradually and then when we now on the t uh, about six years ago we moved to a new building. This is what we have now. So because before LMB uh, it is is the most na narrow uh, lab in the world I believe or everything packed along the corridor now we we can really have the EM unit we uh, uh, so before we just scouting whole the building so at that time we we just buy the cryos the first cryos the split so in fact this cryos is UK is the first cryos but 
on, on this time, on 2007, when we decided the next MISCO, we, we just, uh, Richard and me, we just go the whole, whole world to, to look at. And we will be convinced Polara is the last, uh, uh, the latest mature technique now. So uh, at that time, the, the cryos is, is start, is start built, but the autoloader still a uh, 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 computer monitor, is a robot, is a, a computer simu simulation we were showed. So we say, okay, we don't want to be the first user, don't want to be the guinea pig. So we bought Polara, and then after a lot of years, we let, like uh, so we, we we bought the already second generation of cryos. So uh, we still feel it's the right decision because at that time Polara is really is the one of the workhorse. A lot of high resolution data come from there, and and F32, and we just just all the. The detector, direct detector development from F30 since year 2011, we have the, proto the prototype of the file come, so we, we, we continue from there. So this all the come, but this is all old, old, old slide, I try to change it, but I find it's a, a picture, I cannot change it, can, so I have no time to retype. But I, we, we, on, on this one, we, it's a delivery day, delivery year of the, the Cryos 3, we are our third one. So, but you will see now we, we have we have all we have this. So, um, it's like, like uh, we we have three crowds and in fact uh, two. I think this week, uh, so, so, uh, Friday we have a glaciers de delivery. So this because with all all this is not enough for the for the uh, screen now. It's become a, a, a <coughs> bottleneck. So a lot of people like to to use the like uh, the same cartridge to the cryos. So we say okay, so just buy the glacier. But in fact, we have a lot of other people, um, and we have a lot of other side entry microscope for use from all the time. So we do not have this uh, pre pressure until recently because we are too. We will show you later. We are too the uptime too high now. So we have a, a lot of requirement. So so the building we start from. Because we moved to a new building only five months ago, only six years ago, but then we, we gradually <laughs> get some more until now we only have, have this about near 500 square meters for 10 months ago. It's really, really narrow. You can see one room can put three or four months ago. Yeah, like at the, uh, uh, like a cryos F20, uh, this kind, or even silos, this fit, but they all put in one room. You never see so small. So now we, we plan for a new building. In the new building, we request for for another uh, 1,000 square meter, that's mean it's been half. Uh, what I can anticipate is not, not, not like we have very spacious, uh, very spacious now for new building for next two years, two or three years. Uh, because there are a lot of coming, so that like what some other people already discussed, that we have a low voltage uh, EM coming, we have some uh, like what called connectomics, <laughs> connectomics for neurobiology. So uh, uh, this kind of high large volume EM can and a lot of FIP can. I think like Zeiss people is also here. So we we not just from Silver Future from Zeiss as well. So we are going to have a lot of a uh, lot of thing happen. So at least another six or more coming. So this one thousand square will be not very uh, not very big. But we hope we hope have more like. Uh, Build in purpose EM unit uh, uh, soon. So, so what we are doing? This is one of the uh, This is just an application we I, I summary uh, from there. So, uh, traditionally we are most are the single particle, but uh, of course at the very beginning, uh, people do a lot of sectioning. This is what the Hashri um, uh, like uh, uh, they they do. This is room temperature sectioning, and then. Uh, until uh, uh, Aaron Clark and Nigel Irene and uh, Tony Cloud, <laughs> these are all my boss at the beginning. They are they are basically called back the single from crystallography straight to the, uh, the single particle EM. So mo majority is still the single particle is occupied by eight, by eighty percent. Okay, this is half a year's data, half a year ago, but we certainly increase the new one. But I seem to <laughs> no, I haven't changed it. This figure because the crystallography, in fact, a lot of it started to to do, and so now then the, of course this crystallography, uh, the, the, uh, this uh, not crystallography, uh, the tomography. So the, now tomography we start with, with a traditional tomography and the cryo uh, fib with the cell lamella. So because the time consuming, and then we only have one, so it's, we may we're going to buy buy more, buy another one. So we'll be 
I think a lot of people already start to learn, learn, learn. And then we have other, um, so education, of course, this should be part of tomography. And this is, uh, people have been trying now, the, our, we, we keep polarized because the early polarized have this feature, you can, you know, the, the, uh, the GIF, the GITAN, any filter, you can do, do this, but not, not for the cryos now. Cryos, you have to specially buy. And then we have uh, other, uh, um, well, people still do the, the clamp, the cell biology people, the neurobiology people, and also we, we, we have other, other methods of, of the development. So this is the part of our, uh, what we are, we are doing. And yeah, this is a cryos. So three, three cryos have different configuration. So this is the, but this is two, uh, these are G2. So we got <coughs> G3I. So G3I because it's new, so it got a lot of benefit of lot of lot of software, a lot of new camera put in and it can be used and they're much more fast. But we keep this one as because we got this we we have this feature. <coughs> <coughs> we have this feature but <coughs> there are a lot of problems with it. So <coughs> But still, I think for from this one, we keep it running really well last last year, so we still okay for for it. So another feature is we we keep two polar running, and this is what the um, uh, uh, people use for for we, we still can do helium, and some experiment it so the use and it can be still very really useful, and then we we put the Falcom, uh, we we put K three, we put all sorts of good camera in, so try to. Uh, so people can do it, yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's not many people there to do it. It's really time consuming. But it's still a very good machine. Yeah. This column is uh, except for not very stable like cryos. Yeah, all the poppies, the object lamp poppies, uh, is uh, affectionately much better <coughs> than the C twin in the in cryos. But cryos have others like a very coherent and, and three condensed lens that can get parallel beam. And this kind of thing, and big column with a table. <laughs> so they are they're slightly different, but I think this one keep the if you careful know what you're doing, careful select, careful setup, it's still one of the one of the best microscope. So, yeah, we well, luckily last year with all effort of our uh, facility staff, and we we managed to get a very low downtime. The uh, last year, I'm surprised I put here, <laughs> so never get that that high. Yeah, because think of our people started learning a lot. They even opened the auto loader, <laughs> opened the column to pick up the uh, the, the cartridge. Well, okay, not not quite yet. Is it Polara? This kind of thing. Yeah. So all our we really have lower downtime when we when we get problem in the morning, phone up and maybe afternoon already start use. So we don't need to close. So this figure maybe too optimistic because you have a no whole day. You will the automated record that will say it's not not done, but 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 you can't by hour it's maybe done it's maybe done for some time. But a lot of we have to do ourselves. So we really hope that with a big service contract, the thermal fisher engineer can they can add more to it. It's more help. Otherwise, we have to really train our own our own people. <coughs> oh, oh. <laughs> Yeah, so, uh, so this is the hour we, 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 we pro pro provide. Also, it's just an estimation from, from the, the booking too. But we, yeah, one, one year is about 8,000 8, you know, 8, 8, something hours. So, but we managed to get near, near 6,000 for, for, for some of my scope. And for here, it's really 24 hours, 7 a day. So it's quite heavy with all the people use. This is what just this is the hours by people really use. So not not include the service, not include the shutdown, and uh, 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 this kind of maintenance thing. <coughs> and oh, <coughs> how about the da data collection? So again, what well, this is what the, uh, six six months ago. I think it's quite new. From this is one of the Joanna's um, uh, slide, uh, but uh, uh, oh, it's another slide. But anyway. G sharp is right. Yeah. Okay. Good to have G sharp. So, but we have a new one. So, uh, yeah. So basically, we we got this sister one is a cluster of the EM buffer for take all the storage of the the, the data, and from sister one it will connect, we will connect to scientific scientific computing of of the LMB. So they got 
get got a, a, a lot of like a fast storage, but it's not fast, it's slow. And then you got the fast. Then you got all the processing, like core to processing. But this is now. <coughs> <coughs> We upgrade, uh, so now we duplicate this already. We have CS2. We this is the all the Mac data, um, Mac, um, the Mac data, Mac data, not the movies stored here. Now in between <coughs> we have uh, like uh, another what, what we call the, the on the fly processing uh, cluster or server this kind of thing. So it will be read from cloud class two here. So everything, every all the 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 the, da the data the movie will be duplicate so we will not touch anything here when people already so we got another image like a, on on the fly <coughs> on the fly processing server here so in between they are they set up is they have interrupted uh, reading and processing in between <coughs> six to two and and the on the on fly processing server and on fly processing server I I did not get the uh, <coughs> update uh, slide here. So or with other people are talking about anyway. So we, well, we start very earlier. Uh, we use the rely on, uh, uh, rely on uh, three like a uh, 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 pipeline and yeah, Gregory who uh, is here and Jisapi are doing um, this uh, 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 screening in intensively. So we hope everything can become automatically because we set up very earlier, but not really people like to use, because you have to learn, the user have to learn, and then you have to set up, you have to, to do actual things. So uh, we do not have, have the staff to set up for every user. So in fact, it's not being used, but all the, uh, but all other place already use the, the, the realm or, and the, the script to use, well basically it's a start from Wim, I think. <coughs> Just have to get first copy from Wim and then do all the scripting. Um, we, so now we, we, we are ready to get put in everyone because we, we put every server to everyone. We are, <laughs> have a microscope for now, it's just this year's budget to get proof. We, we will install for and then people will be become automatic. You just need a click, so you don't need to set up a lot of things and then you will read all parameter to, to into it and do more automatically. So but first we maybe just do yeah you screening auto CDF or the um, motion code this kind of thing. But we also have option of do the two D average. Uh, I know what, what the Greek is still plan for do everything or just just for this part. So I think we we have a a, a few steps to carry on. So uh, so maybe the motion code and two D to the class, yeah. I mean, maybe to the uh, class, this will be still. Well, it's the use only. Uh, it should be enough because you won't replace the people use the big one very fast. Uh, the, uh, the the computing to to doing it and hope people can make use the file as well. Don't need to run again because so far a lot of scripting you just look at oh, what data is it good or not, then copy through here. But uh, we want to just make sure that people. Just can just directly copy what the you have result. Just carry on from from the from the high high speed one. So in here also now it duplicate. The, uh, it's double up now. So this figure about half years. Uh, so <coughs> we <coughs> so we just we, we look at back the la last year the, the data we can see is, uh, uh, is uh, we can see the <coughs> the movie uh, the. I think maybe you can see the this more useful the number of the movie produced for these three clouds. You can you can see uh class one is still in our workhorse because these two the the uh, now is uh well now is better now but before it's a lot of lot of downtime and this one only start to use the last year, I think September. La, la, uh, uh, this is, is so we're not fully run, but now it's fully run. So uh we so so um, we pr produce like a, a more more movie, but the whole data we get is less. It's it's much less less. So what oh, is the data? Data per year now is much less. So that means you know our uh, but the daily movie number is is in, in, increased. Uh, that means uh, we we get the the smaller smaller uh, size of the. The movie, and then we, but we got more, so it's a faster and we, we compress. So because a different setting on here, uh, this one is much easier to get everything. So a lot of people use for 
tomography for use CRM so you can save as the compressed form. But all this, there are a lot of people still like use EPU and Falcon. So and and people still save do not save this uncorrected one. Still save the correct everything. So like this is what we have to really have to to training you users say go you use the compressed one. Uh, but hope the new version of EPUE allow to save. Uh, a good compressed T5. So it already the item already there available, but we was told not to use. So there's some problem, but also that there's some some research is on uh, uh, the carry on between source group and then and, and some officials who try to change the format, to try to read this kind of thing. So hope soon the EPU from Falcon also save the. Uh, the the compressor file efficiently and lot of people use so so now the data produced no longer reflect reflect what the, your your achievement now so you want to achievement is how many movie number you have and how small the data set is uh, but it was still sub quite substantial so the EM the the computing still has a big uh, capacity still has a big uh, high high demand for cloud EM. So yeah, this is what I, I mean. But this is the old, old version now. So you, you can uh, uh, this is what uh, like a little command people will say. But and <coughs> also yeah, this is uh, some of the in so in fact is the the CRM. So we try to save this guy a bit and smaller and <coughs> um, so. But I think it's ch changing a lot. Uh, from from now, so will be the new format come out because uh, some of the keep changing their format too. So, well, but we st we still we still have this uh, like one and a half months uh, waiting time for the three microscope, for the, for the three quails. So, but I think the years before is nine week average is nine week. So we managed to reduce. We double the size of the microscope, <laughs> but still. Reduce a little bit, so <coughs> this is a change some aspect of well. So our policy, booking policy, will be different from a lot of other people uh, to use. You can you cannot allow a lot of people like two or three days booking time for a session for all. Then the queue will double or triple. Um, so we so we we manage to give the people long weekend data collection on the quails, doesn't mean you set up on Friday, but don't come back to change it. the grid uh, if you can, don't know how to do it. And then until the Monday morning, this give up time, our staff time for the weekend. We normally do not have weekend, there are a lot of people. Well, if you change it or change the sample or set up, there are a lot of problem. But if you carry on, usually it's no, not, not so. So we find it's quite good. So increase this, give, give the long weekend, not, it, it change, it not, not, not not change this figure when we look back. So and then I will tell you what the, oh, this is why what, what happened. <laughs> yeah, and then this is uh, others is seem to all in normal. Just just this one, just just this one. So it's not good like uh, at the EM home facility. It's uh, it's not too bad if you have a service if you are the service like a, a national f facility only for data collection and people can schedule then or go anyway. But for the EM. For home facility, you have to give people everything, um, what, whatever they want. So they need a very short time. They, they may be like before Tony Crowd always booking in midnight, yeah, 12 o'clock. This is when I start. I'm very surprised. And Richard Henderson <coughs> is spending normally from 9 o'clock in the evening. I say I want to go with him do the 2D crystal of this uh, bacterial adoption. He said, OK, 9 o'clock tomorrow night. Nine oh, morning. Then no, nine o'clock in the evening. So, <coughs> and he also need everything running twenty four hours, all carbon coated, or on the city never stop. He said whenever he need in the midnight or somewhere, he can come as a use. So there's a different requirement for home facility and the national facility, for example. Uh, so this is still not reach the target. So we have to allow people screening even in the crowds. You told them say, oh, you only have twenty four hours. No quiz, no screening, but they can't. They say, but where can screening? This is the home facility. I want to do every everything what they w w we want. So, so okay, the group just uh, do, do together. Say okay, you have two group. You have group. You have three people. You book three day. You know, but each people still want twenty four hours. Oh, the first few hours you do all your screening for the group, and then you can do. 
So uh, this is what the, the comprise. <coughs> so this is some of the statistics. Maybe I don't know if you can see uh, because I try to squeeze it into one one one. Um, So um, yeah, so we got the, we still with this with all the combination because all the mice got we own the K three on only on one class, so you you don't no no choice and then just start use last. No no no, uh, just start this year, is it May we will start yeah, is it May? So so only a little bit, uh, but almost ninety percent in class three that uh, use K three now because it's fast. And we still this is class two and class one, and but Falcon still yeah most. But you can see this figure really deals now. Uh, the one I gave the half years ago, the data cover the one year, the more the uh, earlier half year. Is uh, this one uh, still much much more? Um, and then so the uh, the face play yeah it deals as as expect, yeah, but still have some people use. Because uh, and you know, but because you know in um, the people we, we give the OT people set up themselves say oh usually if they work for the their sample they just follow don't want to change so uh, this is what still have and well, of course the tomography uh, uh, tomography most are doing uh, use K two or K K three just the usual and tomography plus <coughs> plus face play uh, is uh, is much less now before it's more. And then the uh, totally first play last year still have this figure. <laughs> but look like because it's so difficult to use. And then the K3 really, the new new app, but not really uh, compatible with, with uh, in uh, this one. So we will predict it will be reduced soon. So yeah, we just think, yeah, okay, I think this, this figure, I think. Um, we got a lot of people left, and then now I think we just calculate uh, this month is 155 active user. That's mean at that moment, now like that. If people, I think, uh, quickly make a very good program to get rid of all the the fake booking <laughs> and uh, uh, just automatically read how many people really active use at the moment, at, at this month. So we have this figure. So we have three clouds. So each class, of course, you, you need this <laughs> one and a half months. So you cannot keep people longer. And so I can explain why our yen waiting time still five to six weeks when you double the amount of yen time give to people. Because the user just keep, the new user keep up. And each user have more than one project. Uh, so this is why we, 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 we keep busy and still not enough. <coughs> so the very previous email I show you we use is uh, like uh, three years ago, the EBIC start. We have EBIC people here. We really support this one. And I think LMB become one of the, is it the biggest user of this one now. Yeah, because we really don't have enough time. And EBIC offer two to three day so data collection. So it's, it's very nice. And also we people use all sorts of facility they, they have. The least one become part of Institute, the uh, uh, Crystal server. Yeah, before part of our facility now, you have another Miglan client facility. Yeah, one of the big users is LMB. And lot of MEM, uh, Creek. Uh, we, and even next, uh, go to Ambos. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so, so come to here. I believe, I believe that some, some people can come to come here. And, and even generally found in the US, so they explore all the use. use. Um, <coughs> so <coughs> so uh, LMB have uh, 50, 50, I think 50 now increase more, 52, so at least 40 group are used. <coughs> so, so not like, a, not just structural biology. So yeah, this is what the, with the situation we have to cope with cope at, at, at this. So, <coughs> so the one of the biggest part I always say is the user user training. <coughs> so Joanna gave a very good summary of um, of the our 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 training in in here. 
So this is what the, the number, the session, the what we, we get. And here, in fact, this, this two-day session is really just covered the loading sample. And EPU, a whole people in here already give some, already have some uh, is, uh, chain. Uh, <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry. <coughs> I will say the first half year of the class you you always have problems. So you is we are not sit there, but you have to be prepared on call. So all the <coughs> people wish us to prepare today is your own call. So people will call you for all sorts of things, and particularly when they have a have this kind of thing, CoEM. If if they have to learn or uh, face plate and to or tomography, you have to really <laughs> help a lot. So the, the, the training is our big part of the job. We cannot sit with people for all the setup, but perhaps we should request more staff and do this. It will be much easier, straightforward. You just sit there and, and then guide people to do whatever, whatever they request and should be short, sorting the setup time and reduce the dropping cartridge in the column or break down the holder. Uh, but we, now I think we really uh, do not, cannot get more. <laughs> we only get two. Hope to next year get three. But what Richard Henderson say, we never have EM manager before I come. <laughs> so that's mean all group leaders have to learn. But now I don't know how many group leaders can do quite EM. Uh, sorry about that. <laughs> uh, <coughs> oh, sorry. Yo, maybe um, yeah. Maybe we already uh, talk. Uh, is it the time now? <laughs> uh, we uh, maybe talk a little bit. <coughs> uh, so we handle this because the the thing is, I will try to talk about how we handle this big uh, user. So at the beginning, we say everyone have to send us a cloud EM photo. We want to see when the sample ready. Then you start to book clouds. Uh, Start book. So we have a stack, we got all the training, then this training is waiting for sample. If we got sample ready, we give to you. <coughs> and yeah, this is quite efficient at the beginning because we calculate, say, 3,000 pounds a day, just the running cost minus staff and the room. This is a consumable and machine depreciation, so it's uh, 3,000 pounds a day. If you waste your time, this is wasted the, a waste of day, it's a waste of money. <coughs> and sometimes Greg will have a peek, say, oh, people who collect, uh, collect some uh, garbage, they were told. But after a few months, we decide to stop. Because uh, you can't do this. <laughs> the group will say, oh, uh, I cannot, don't cancel my session, I change immediately other people's one. I'll say, oh, no, 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 this is, uh, this is, they send us the good data set. And when they add something, change something, add another cofactor or everything, now it's a new data, but they do not <coughs> send us again because they're only in. So they are so always a new sample you don't know. So eventually say we're well, well, going not going to produce this thing. So <coughs> so we we do not do this, we do not have committee decide <coughs> who is going to use. We only rely on there's a booking online booking application form, very good uh, GSAP is, uh, online one. So select what your experience, uh, what your project, how long you'll be in LMB. If less than one year, stop, no training. If you, uh, you have experience, that's good. We get a very fast <coughs> route. If no experience, you start from here and waiting for some producer, a routine one. So if you have a, if the data is your main purpose, then we go to a fast track. We uh, just we, we not we just quickly training and already book you in here because I have a one and a half month waiting time and we seek to for for you set up data set and then you do the processing if you this what you want if you are serious EM user you want you stay more than one year and then you are going to learn EM then we we we, we training we training on here this is a second half uh, half of the advanced training then we not ship with you but schedule time can come for uh, quite a, a few months training. So <coughs> we do separate of this. Some, some group would also give you data, get, give you a grid, say, uh, say no, could you just book extra time? We, we just want data. So this is kind of two, two things. Um, <coughs> this, uh, um, we also have a booking policy, which is just you only book one session in advance. 
we have the carrying the car pendulum can set a lot of loop. You only can book one month scope of this this 300 kV. One session, you have, when you have finished and write down all the feedback, then you have a right to book next one. So we don't need to keep an eye on it. <coughs> and <coughs> we also have the um, this then the we are not depend on we do not decide the the of time for the group. We decide by the project. <coughs> a project have to be well, it's a per person. If have a, one person have three projects, sorry, you only count as one. So this one, so if you have a visitor, you have a collaborator on the bring sample in. No, sorry, use your quota. We cannot extend. So on this way, we lead the group to decide their time. If your group have four or five use, uh, trained user, you have four or five days, then you can arrange yourself. This three day is for one of the project to collect data, another three day maybe screen or other <coughs> or other short project. So then we just reduce our time to handle this. Um, <coughs> uh, and also uh, the training, yeah, I think this is what we have. Yeah, yeah, that's right. So 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 hope this is a kind of screening, uh, like uh, can do some filter before they all reach the EM to handle this uh, 155 active users. But in, in the booking, in fact, it's 200 because some people only come run randomly, not count. Yeah. So we have the EM. Yeah, we have a <coughs> we have four people here, or include me, and then Joanna just left. He he's, she's here for set up his own facility. Uh, half years ago, and Chris chose, yeah, la last year, uh, uh, she, she moved set up his group, group now, but uh, they do need to contribute to all our program and uh, set up uh, a lot. And we have a lot of uh, core EM group, which are almost here, like the Richard group, yeah, I think Richard's about all the early months ago for us anyway, and Greg, all the detector, all the computer set up, he's uh, really good on, on this. And YG is a, is a detector <coughs> that a pioneer, so we will benefit with all the prototype test. And we have Chris Russo's group, and now so he he has a, he set up his group and now have a users. Good, he almost occupied the program. <coughs> and with John Brick, with doing a lot of tomography, and Yang also the Yang and Wang Da is a two group really do a a cryo fibbing a million and cellular thing, and then. And then the tomography, so they are, they have a training to the user a lot, and then also we have scientific computer and the workshop. So, yeah, this is what we have now. Oh. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe we have time for one or two questions, but then I think we should move on. So, how long do you keep your raw data? Because the amounts of data are so huge that they exceed their storage capacities within the year. Yeah, so I do think that. Store them only one year, or do the groups have separate storages where they do the long term storage? If the long, long term one, yes, uh, scientific computer only keep for is it half a year. Uh, the scientific keep for half a year, and then also not the raw data. The data, the people exploit whatever they save for from the group. So we usually give the user this eight terabit external drive. This is to get from LMB store very cheap. They order together all format <coughs> to EM. But the EM and then you just everyone so everyone have a pile of this. This is your all the raw data. And then your active data in the scientific computing if you you not touch it. I don't know it's just there's a, there are three months in beef you have to delete and, and there's half year somewhere in delete. And then EM, the, the server you will not last for, if uh, over 24 hours in, a, in, a, in a risk, but they'll automatic copy over uh, every 20 minutes, copy to the, uh, the system. This is what the EM buffer between the EM and the, and the scientific computer. This one, automatic copy the movie only. Uh, this one keep uh, theoretically is uh, one week. But because we have a capacity quite big now, so one month is still okay. And if you talk to Greg, so maybe you can extend to three months. So yeah, this is, a, but the, we still have the menu one, very safe. People keep the eight terabit data <laughs> disk. Yeah, uh, of course, LMB have another backup, some other building. This is all required for the safety. <laughs> uh, 
Okay, thank you very much. Uh, let's thank uh, Xiao Xiao again and then I think we should...